Oh, I love that music. All right, what have you got for us? Oh my god, it really is! This is Silent Hill 2 remake? Oh my god, it's James! Could she really be here? Waiting for me? Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. <laughs> no! You shut the hell up right now! In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. Kirio works back. Blue Patine, yeah, that's we heard that rumor a long time ago. Pyramid head! I know what you are. There's that little shit, Laura. I know why I need it. Just look at it. But it's all over now. I don't need you anymore. Holy shit. Konami, you have no right! Mary? Oh, there's Maria. Yes! Yes! It's true! The rumors were true, the leaks were true. I can't believe it. Console exclusive, also available on PC, so it's a timed exclusive. Oh, that music. Welcome to Silent Hill Transmission, the show that keeps you informed about Silent Hill. My name is Selena, and I'll be your facilitator. Thank you very much for having me. And? Silent Hill シリーズのプロデューサーを務める岡本元井です。今日はよろしくお願いします。まずはじめにサイレントヒル2の映像をご覧いただきました。そしてですね、より詳しくお伝えするために一緒にゲームを作っている人をお呼びしています。では早速ご紹介いたします。コンセプトアーティストの伊藤正弘さんです。伊<笑>藤さん今日はよろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。改めまして岡本さん伊藤さんサイレントヒルが帰ってくるんですねはいそうなんですファンの皆さん本当に大変お待たせしましたサイレントヒルが帰ってきて第一弾としてサイレントヒル2をリメイクいたします伊藤さんにお声がけしたからそろそろ三年ですよねいや本当長かったですよねでもこうしてこのタイトルをまたこう再始動できるっていうそのタイミングを皆さんにお伝えできる。So、why two specifically? Why, why, why not one? あの伊藤さんの場合、ツイッターにもすごくファンの方がコメントされているので、もう隠してるのが大変だったんじゃないですか。いやそうなんですよ。あの岡本さんにあの苦情されてましたから。特<笑>に<笑>あの本当にファンからいろいろ質問されて、それをのらりくらいと交わすのが大変でして。いや僕らもちょっと脇で見ていて、あのちょっとドキドキしておりました。<笑>それでですね、サイレントヒルといえばもう一方。作曲家の山岡明さん山岡さんとも一緒に作っているんですけれどもちょっと本日はですね残念ながらこの場に来られなかったのでビデオメッセージをお預かりしておりますどうぞご覧ください
山岡ですもう21年ですか20年以上経った作品でリメイクという形でまた新しい作品としてですねよみがえるということでまあ個人的にも僕的にもすごく嬉しく思っています。うん、当時はそのいろいろこうチャレンジしようというか、うん、ビデオゲームっていう中でも新しいものというか今までないものをたいテーマとしても作ろうみたいなところもあって当時ディレクターがドストエフスキーの「罪と罰」を読んでくださいって言われて何を作るんだろうなと。で音楽ももちろんですけど模索というかすごいいろいろチャレンジしてた思いではあります。このタイトルであれば新しい音楽っていうものを作り上げられるかなっていうのはすごい感じてましたいまあ、未だに20年経ってもですね「サイレントヒルっていうタイトルがみんなの心の中に残ってるっていうのは僕はすごくやってよかったというか本当にこの上ない嬉しさというか気持ちでもありますでリメイクに関してもまたさらに新しい音楽性であったり新しいチャレンジもそうかもしれないですし従来のファンの方にもきちっと届けられる心に刺さるサウンドデザインだったり音楽だったり、ま、もちろん「サイレントヒルを知らない「サイレントヒル2」を知らないユーザーさんにとってもその時「サイレントヒル2」が初めて出た時のインパクトというか衝撃というか作れたらいいなと。思っています、えー、皆さんもぜひ楽しみにしていてください。Oh, well, we are. I very much am. Thank you. コナミのサウンドね若いスタッフみんな山岡さんのことを尊敬しているのでみんなワクワクしながら一緒に仕事させていただいておりますそしてですね日本だけでなく制作チームについてのお話もさせてください今回の「サイレントヒル2」はポーランドのホラーゲームのスペシャリストブルーバーバチームで制作しています、まあ、彼らからコメントと制作風景をいただいてますのでこちらもどうぞご覧ください「サイレントヒル2」is a cult classic and it's widely recognized as one of the best games ever made、Absolutely. for many Bluebird team members Silent Hill is the title which made them fall in love in horror games This is why we approach our work with a great respect to original game. To ensure that we are keeping this unique Silent Hill atmosphere intact, we are working closely with original creators such as Masahiro Ito and Akira Yamaoka. Holy shit, look at it! Hermit Head, look at him! We want Silent Hill 2 to make the same strong impression today that the original game did 21 years ago. Jesus, While we want to achieve the same、years. end result, players' expectations evolve over time, and certain things need to be modernized to have the same or similar effect. For example, that's why we went with the over the shoulder camera, so we can immerse players into the game world as much as possible. Nice. James looks awesome. We are creating a synergy where new or modernized mechanics and features actually support the original spirit of Silent Hill 2. Combining the old with the new is no easy task, but we believe we are on the right track. Nice motion capture. Oh, there's Maria. To put it simply, our goal is to recreate everything what made the game a timeless classic, but give it a new form which will draw players even deeper into the foggy streets of Silent Hill. Look at it! How dare you! How dare you come back looking this damn good! <laughs> すごいですこの現場から「サイレントヒル2」が生まれたんですねそうなんですよもう彼らは本当にホラーゲームと「サイレントヒル」が大好きでコナミって「サイレントヒル」に関しては世界中のチームから毎年のように提案をいただくんですけれども、はい、その中でも彼らは最もですね情熱的ですごく愛を感じました素晴らしい伊藤さんも一緒にポーランド行きましたよねはいあのー年の瀬のあの寒いポーランドに行きましたね。で何度も何度もね、<笑>あのお酒を飲み、語り合い、はいはい
でも岡本さんがねこう酔っ払って<笑><笑>そうですねあの一緒にもうあのお酒を飲みながらホラーゲームの未来そしてあのサイレンティルの未来について熱く語り<笑>、はい、そしてゲームを一緒に作るということですねはい、はい、ところでですね、えー、先ほどの映像にもロゴが出ておりましたけれどもサイレントヒル2はプレイステーション5で発売予定ですそこでプレイステーション5の発売元のソニーインタラクティブエンターテインメントさんからもコメントをいただいておりますビデオメッセージをどうぞご覧ください Hello everyone My name is Christian Svensson and I'm the Vice President of Global Third Party Relations at Sony Interactive Entertainment I'm extremely excited to hear about the announcement of Silent Hill 2 Congratulations This is definitely a celebratory moment And we're looking forward to bringing Silent Hill 2 exclusively to PlayStation 5. Being huge fans of the franchise, our team at SIE feels fortunate and excited to support the revival of Silent Hill. Okamoto san, we eagerly await hearing more about what's in store for this beloved franchise. Thank you again for your partnership. Thank you very much. Silent Hill is a PlayStation to come to the next series. PlayStation to come to the next series. 皆様のサイレントヒル2に寄せる期待がすごいですね。私自身サイレントヒル2も大ファンなので、もうお話聞いてるだけでますます楽しみになってきました。ありがとうございます。あのファンの皆様にはですね、あの本日からプレイステーション5のスターページもオープンしていますので、そちらの方もチェックしてみてください。よろしくお願いします。はい、そうなんですね。わかりました。ファンとしてすぐにチェックさせていただきます。それではこの回はこのあたりで、岡本さん、伊藤さん、ありがとうございました。私たちのいる世界も変わってきましたよはいこのイベントはサイレントヒル2だけでは終わらないんです今後は世界中の才能あふれるクリエイターたちとサイレントヒルの世界をさらに拡大していきますまだ続きがあるんですかはいそしてその新しいビジョンの一つをお披露目することができるんですビデオの方をご覧ください OK so... Why are you here? No, in this place, why are you here? <laughs> You're to be punished. That's good, I like it. You know what? I think you're right. I think we've done something so awful. And we are stuck here in this place, being judged by these people. But for you, I think it's more than that. I think you're here for some other reason. And I don't want to be anywhere near you. Can you figure that out? Townfall. Okay. I want to know more about this. Hi, my name is John McKellen. I'm the creative director at No Code, and we are working on Silent Hill Townfall. I remember playing the original Silent Hill on PS1 back in 1999 and became a fan from that moment on. So, for us to work on this game with our friends at Annapurna feels like an actual dream come true. It's a real honour for us to bring a new title to this series that both respects the source material but also does something a little bit different with it. To say that Silent Hill has been an inspiration to No Code would be a massive understatement. Our previous two games, Stories Untold and Observation, both played with that same deep psychological horror. And at No Code, we're all about weaving that narrative and that experience into every aspect of our game design, our audio, our visuals, even our UI. So obviously, the teaser trailer is just the beginning, and we can't show you any more just yet. We're going to be hard at work for a while,、uh, but we can't wait to come back in the new year and show you more. Until then, it might be worth watching that trailer again and see what you might have missed. Ooh, okay. I'm not familiar with that. 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 サイレントヒルの新作を一緒に作ってくれるこれ以上ないパートナーだと思ってますそうなんですかこの他にも新たなパートナーはいらっしゃるんでしょうかはい
まだ今日は言えないんですけれども同様に素晴らしい才能を持ったチームと今後のパートナーシップを拡大していく予定ですそれは素晴らしいですねタウンホールが楽しみですありがとうございますではタウンホールの話はひとまずここまでにして次の話題に移っていきたいと思いますはい次は何でしょう実はサイレントヒルはゲーム以外の展開もあるんですここではその情報をお伝えしていきますなるほどまた新しい楽しみが増えますねではここでアシスタントプロデューサー内藤瑠衣さんをお迎えしてその新たな展開について伺っていきましょう内藤さんお願いいたしますサイレントヒルの IP 展開クロスメディア展開を担当しています内藤ですよろしくお願いしますよろしくお願いします内藤さん今回はどんな情報をお持ちいただいたんでしょうか今回はですねサイレントヒルゲームの復活のきっかけともなった映画化の話です数年前に映画のもともと作ってた映画のプロデューサーの方から最新作作りたいという提案をいただきました、えー、監督はあの第一作の方を演出されたクリストフ・ガンズ氏が手掛けるとでさらにまあいいプロットいい企画をいただいてこれはいい映画になるぞというところで進めてきましたただですね、まあ、映画だけでいいのかというところもあってこれはゲームを復活させたいということもあって、まあ、隣にいるプロデューサーの岡本と一緒に、まあ、ゲームと一緒に復活する道のりを歩んできたという感じになりますなるほど素晴らしいですねではここであのそのプロデューサー監督2名から熱いメッセージいただいているのでご覧ください。Still haven't seen the second Silent Hill movie yet. The first one I really liked.はい。I have the chance of being very close with Christoph, and we together h a s achieved to, to convince Konami that there is a new、uh, version of Silent Hill that needs to be done, and they are 100% on board. Fantastic! In the first Silent Hill, we were exploring a world, the world of this small town completely closed into, into the mist. It was like being trapped into the, a Twilight Zone. But in the second game, you know, the, the creator of the game has changed the rules. You know? We were basically going back to Silent Hill, the same town, but we were looking at this strange world entirely through the, the point of view of the hero we were playing. Mary. It's not really a hero, really, but yeah. We realize that Mary is lost somewhere into this strange place. At his core, it's also the idea of the myth of Orpheus. And whatever a, a man can go deep in hell to bring back the soul or the person he loved the most in his life. So it's much more about psychological horror. Even if we are going to find again all the same creature and the same strange terror sequence, something like that, but the first big interrogation and the first big terror. Is about ourselves. Are we mad? Probably. Are we sane? Definitely.、Uh, are we sane to go back to Silent Hill to find this great love? Absolutely not. <laughs> this one now has so many years from the first one that there is a clear idea from Kristoff to make it modern but also. Very true to the video game, and that's also what it is. We are also respecting the will of the author, the producers, and Konami into this、uh, adaptation. Christoph, it's really somebody that respects the work that has been done, but that also has his own vision. It nurtures the creative vision of the authors from the game, but with a different vision from a filmmaker. And both they have created, I believe, something that has struck the minds of the fans. James! Hi, Maria. Stop! Leave her alone! It's a 
game of Silent Hill franchise were great artistic achievements. And I have a responsibility to transpose that on a big screen, you know. Christoph is a real gamer. He has been immersed in this world. That's why um, the first film was so well received by the fans of Silent Hill, because they felt that uh, I was one of them. It was a great it film. It was so important for me to, to respect the original creation, you know. It that, showed that, that game base, adaptations uh, could be done everything. well. Everything starts from this respect. So I'm going with a maximum of humility, a maximum of respect, but in the same time, I have quite a charge, quite a goal, which is how to transpose the language of the game, which is entirely about immersion, into a tale, into a story that we can tell in 90 or 100 minutes. The monsters are also one of the key elements that the fans are waiting for. And we are updating those in a way that the creation is similar, but they will be striking. For me, one of my major goals in, in, in this film is how to redesign the classic monster of Silent Hill. Uh, I was talking about Red Pyramid, you know, the big guy with the helmet, you know. He's, again, in this one. Some of the creatures of the film of uh, back in uh, 2006 were very, very appreciated by, by the fans. But in the same time, for me, it was, it was important to come back with, with surprise. It's a new universe. It's a new challenge. And those are very important to bring these icons differently to the audience because they want them to have that wow effect. <laughs> That's why, you know, I found a very interesting collaboration with the people of Konami. They helped me a lot to achieve this new design of the monster, because they are also working on new episodes for the franchise of Silent Hill. The younger audience, they want that collective experience. They want to be with their friends, they want to talk about it, but they want also to live that experience together. We all know that uh, watching an horror film alone at his home is quite different of being into a big theater with a crowd and, and everybody jumping at the same time. Uh, that's true. It's very different. We are modernizing. We are giving him what the audience of today is really wanting. We are trying to do as much as possible, creating a new experience for that audience. Could be more immersive, interactive, and we have now new technologies, but we still have what makes the best is the story, and this story is at the core of it. So we hope that Return to Silent Hill will be a great return. I'm looking forward to it. If we want uh, to keep the link with the audience, you know, we have to, to be perfectly aware that everything has changed in 15 years. Everything has been washed away, you know. We have to bring back something, you know, very surprising. All right, game on, Christoph. I'm looking Producer, forward to seeing what you've got. Producer, thank you very much. I'm going to win the game to win the game. The game and 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 the game. さっきのあの映像の中にもあったと思うんですけど、まあすでに絵コンテとかイメージボードとかあるんですけど、実は撮影とかキャスティングはまだこれからなんですね。まあ今後いろいろ映画の方も山場がいっぱいあると思うんで、こちらの方もまあゲームと一緒にいい作品になるように進めていきたいと思ってます。ありがとうございます。映画も楽しみです。この配信をご覧の皆さんもぜひ楽しみにお待ちくださいね。Oh, I very much. それではこの回もそろそろ内藤さん、岡本さんありがとうございました。Alright, what's next? Buy some merch. From here, I would like to share with you some of Silent Hill related items that will help you enjoy the game even more. Here is the first one we would like to introduce. From Gecko, you all very know, one sixth scale statue of Red Pyramid Thing is coming. Thoroughly <laughs> supervised by the art director and the monster designer of Silent Hill 2, Masahiro Ito, all details are brushed up. You can even see the details we couldn't express because of the video game spec at the time. The nice. base capturing the scaffold can be connected and you can recreate the scene of the final fight against two red pyramid things. Ooh. 
Up next, James Sunderland 1-6 scale statue. The realistic sculpture perfectly captures James's exhaustive facial expression. Not only the handgun, but also the wooden plank, the steel pipe, and the great knife pairing up with bread pyramid thing can be held in his right hand. At his feet, health drinks are tossed away. Maria from Silent Hill 2 is also coming as a 1-6 scale statue. Nice! It is the very first official statue of Maria, with the high quality and beautiful details. The right hand is interchangeable with a hand holding the gun, which appears in the sub-scenario Born from a Wish. Last but not least, the secret <laughs> ending of Silent Hill 2, Inu End, is also recreated as a 1-6 scale coin bank statue. The diorama statue will remind you of the last scene where James collapse to his knees and say, so it was all your work. From here, we will introduce some products from the official Konami shop. First, Silent Hill board collection. We made a collection that encapsulates all that horror and eeriness, featuring legendary characters from the first four installments of the franchise. These hand-numbered limited decks are now available for pre-order. In the official Konami shop, all these products are now available. Please check it out. Cool. Here is further information about Silent Hill goods. From Crazy Rock, 1-6 scale fully articulated collectible figures of Red Pyramid Thing and Bubblehead Nurse are coming. They are high quality and fully articulated. They look damn good. From Good Smile Company, Papa Parade Bubblehead Nurse is coming with affordable prices. Papa Parade is a series of figures that are easy to collect. Each figure typically stands around 17 to 18 centimeters in height. From Bedrock Collectibles, Red Pyramid Thing and Maria Elevator Chase Diorama is coming. Mm. This statue diorama captures a moment in time as Red Pyramid Thing readies to swing his great blade while Maria attempts to run away and reach the elevator in time with her outreached hand. This diorama will be coming soon to the Bedrock Collectibles website. Konami is proud to present all these items on Silent Hill e-commerce page. Don't miss it and secure your order. Oh, they're also going to recreate ones from the reboot in Silent Hill 2. Nice. Now the scene has changed and we have our next guest. Our next guest is Jacob Navok. Jacob, please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Jacob Navok and I'm the CEO at Genbit. Jacob, what will you be presenting this time? I'm going to show you a new kind of Silent Hill an experience that you haven't seen up until now. A whole new experience. What is it all about? Please take a look at this video for him. Right? What you got for us, Jacob? Oh, yes. kind of live experience maybe? Well, this is going to be another world of Silent Hill. Jacob, could you please introduce your project? For over 20 years, Silent Hill has haunted my memories. And lately, I enjoy watching streamers playing Silent Hill with their fans. We love the feeling of being scared together, of experiencing fear with friends. It's why watching horror films in the theater is so fun. Silent Hill Ascension takes that feeling of communal fear to a massive scale is a live, real-time, interactive series where millions of fans will watch together as the chilling story unfolds. Oh, okay. You can change its outcomes and even be a part of scenes. There is no reset button. Decisions that you make mean life or death in the story. It's your chance to shape Silent Hill canon forever. 
Silent Hill Ascension is brought to you by Genvid, Bad Robot, Behavior, and DJ2. and goes live in 2023. Sign up at ascension.com for updates. I'm so excited about this new world of Silent Hill. Here are some messages we received from two important partners in the project. Before we look at the messages, could you please introduce them? Today we're going to hear from Bad Robot as well as Behavior. I see. Okay, first things first. I would like to read a message from director J.J. Abrams. Ugh. Genvit's experience presents a wild, epic, and innovative new way to immerse yourself in the horrors of Silent Hill. Next, please watch the message from the art director of Bad Robot and the creative team of Behavior Interactive. I'm Chris Amaral from Bad Robot Games and art director for Silent Hill Ascension. Our approach to Silent Hill Ascension is to ensure we maintain the tone and the feeling that the fans have come to love from the franchise, while also adding our own twist of an oppressed, tormented, and morose dimension of reality. Silent Hill creatures are often manifested projections from the darkest depths of the main character's minds. In Silent Hill Ascension, we build off of this. Our creatures are inspired by the personal traumas and internal demons of our characters' past lives. We want the art style to be a fresh take on the brand, while still being equally respectful to where we've been before. In 2021, we released The Executioner and the survivor Cheryl Mason in Dead by Daylight. Today, behavior once again will dive into the world of Silent Hill, but with a completely new experience. Here's Chris, VP Creative of our service division to tell you all about it. Everyone at Behavior is excited to announce our collaboration with Genvid on Silent Hill Ascension in a new form of entertainment that blends community, live storytelling, and interactivity. Silent Hill Ascension takes you and the entire community on a unique interactive storytelling experience where the decisions you make affect the characters and the world. Those decisions become canon and there's no reset button. This is a whole new chapter for Silent Hill with new characters and frightful monsters where the stakes couldn't be more real. We're thrilled to be working with the talented teams at Genvid, Bad Robot, and DJ2 to bring Silent Hill Ascension to life. Look for it to go live in 2023 and sign up at ascension.com for updates. I can see the new charm of Silent Hill. The fun okay. only gets better. Jacob, what do you think of the two message videos? I am thrilled to work with these incredible teams. Together, we're gonna revolutionize what horror means in interactive media. That's fantastic, we are excited too. I hope everyone watching this distribution is eagerly awaiting this new Silent Hill. I'm sure you will not be disappointed. Thank you, Jacob, for sharing your fascinating title with us today. Thank you for your time, Jacob. Thank you very much. Hi. 実は最後にもう一本サイレントヒルの完全新作の発表があります。我々が自信を持って送り出す新しいサイレントヒルです。Thank you very much. Finally, we will leave you with that completely new video. Thank you for watching Silent Hill Transmission. Right, what's this last one? No actual gameplay footage.
Okay. Silent Hill F. Okay. Interesting. Well, Silent Hill's definitely backing in a huge way. Definitely looking forward to the Silent Hill 2 remake. That looks awesome. Definitely looking forward to the next Silent Hill movie. But I'm looking forward to all of it. Silent Hill's back. I'm excited. <laughs> I just can't believe it. All of those rumours were true. Thank Christ. Anyway, I'm out. Catch you next time.